Hi there, I hope you're well. My name's Joe Hazel, lead guitar player for British band Curse of Lono. I'm here in association with Performer Magazine to talk about the OptiWeb range of coated electric guitar strings developed by Elixir. So the lovely people at Performer Magazine in the United States have very kindly made Curse of Lono the Elixir Strings Artist of the Month for June 2019, which is a great honour and privilege for us. As such, they've asked us to have a quick chat about why we like using Elixir products and particularly the OptiWeb coated electric guitar strings. So with that in mind, I've come here to one of my favourite places in the whole world. This is Woodbury Recording Studios in Essex. I'm here in the control room and we're going to give these strings a decent road test. So the OptiWeb strings are designed to give you all the benefits of a coated string. The main one essentially being that they're very durable and they'll last you for ages. But alongside that, they also give you the feel and the playability of a, of a natural uncoated string. So I've had the strings on, on this Strat and this SG for probably three, three and a half weeks now. And I've absolutely hammered them from a playing perspective. And I have to say, in terms of feel, uh, they still feel more or less exactly as they did uh, when they first went on the guitars. And from a tonal perspective, they're very much still holding their tone, which, when it really comes down to things, is, is the most important aspect that we're looking for in a string. <laughs> So let's talk in a bit more depth about feel. One of the main things with the OptiWeb string is that the coating is, is so thin it barely notices. Uh, this is definitely my, my experience with using them thus far. Um, if you'd given me this guitar five minutes ago and hadn't told me what specific type of strings were on, I would have definitely said uh, that they were probably an uncoated string. Now that perhaps shows that I know nothing about anything, but definitely my experience from playing them is that the, the coating is thin enough that you really, really don't notice it in the same way that you have done with coated strings in the past. Um, again, with feel, in terms of the playability, I think there's a real slickness and smoothness to the strings. You can really glide around the fretboard quite nicely, and I've found that's particularly handy when it comes to more legato playing, when you can really slide around the fretboard really, really comfortably and really nicely. On top of this, I'd also say that the responsiveness of the strings is really consistent, and this might sound like a totally boring point, but when I first put the strings on, uh, for the next three, four days, every time I pick the guitar up, still felt exactly as they had done the day before. Now with other strings my experience has sometimes been that when you first restring the guitar as the strings settle in and bed in to being under tension over the first few days they can behave a little bit variably. With these OptiWebs as soon as they went on I played them in for 30-45 minutes and for the next few days they just performed exactly as they had done the day before really really consistently and I have to say that, that that's continued for the ensuing three three and a half weeks that I've been using them. It may be a boring point but it's one less thing to worry about in life, and that's never a bad thing. Let's talk about tone. With these OptiWebs, I have to say that the tone is, is really tight and very crisp and there's, there's plenty of clarity to everything, which I'm really fond of. Historically, I think people have maybe avoided coated strings because the trade-off for all the uh, durability and longevity you get with the coating is that sometimes that coating means that the tone is a bit dampened or deadened. With these OptiWebs, that's definitely not the case. They completely deliver. Particularly at the high end, there's a real punch and a real clarity to everything. But at the same time, the low end has got a really nice shine to it, but still gives you the grit and the punch that you want. 
And unless you're a guitar player that likes to scoop your mids, uh, I also think that clarity again shines through when you get into the mid-range frequencies too. Now, obviously tone is totally subjective. We've all got our thoughts on what we like to hear. But for me, as someone that doesn't like too much mud and likes a bit of punch and clarity, these Octawebs are absolutely great. So, to summarise, the Elixir Optiwebs give you all the durability and longevity that you'd expect from a coated string, but at the same time they now give you the, the feel and the playability of an uncoated option. In terms of the tone, it's everything I could want, hopefully it'd be everything that you could want too. It's bright, it's punchy and there's loads of clarity, and most importantly that tone's going to last. Whether you're out playing on the road every night of the week, playing in studios every day, or if you're playing in your living room every night, that tone's gonna last, it's really gonna pay dividends and you're really gonna appreciate that. So, Elixir Optiwebs, what's not to like? Go check them out.